Hi, good morning. We're at McRitchie. The first annual the North Face 100 run. It consists of two runners, each running 50, and the combined time, the best combined time, will be the winner. In the North Face 100, we're at Rifle Range Road. The weather outside of this uh, forest is dry, it's dry and humid outside, but in here it's very moist. So you can see the moisture on these leaves. Um, it's cool because they're protected from the sun, but once they get out of the forest, it's gonna yeah, be warm yeah. again. Wet. Not because it's running, but because it's very warm and humid. Even in this jungle, it's very warm and humid, and they're perspiring and they're losing a lot of water. And um, I hope they keep hydrated because they're going to be needing the hydration to prevent cramps um, or any sort of thing like that. So, because if, that, if anything happens in this jungle, medical attention is very hard to get. And now, if medical attention do come, it'll take time. So, um, heat stroke and all stuff um, and dehydration um, problems can play a part in this race, so they've got to be sufficiently uh, hydrated. Welcome to the North Face 100, we're at Rifle Range Road.
right now we're in Bukit Timah. This is one of the trails. It's actually going up and it's actually quite treacherous because it rained yesterday and it's actually very slippery. So if you're not careful, you could lose your grip and you could fall. Now the trail is very slim and only one person can fit up and they're going upwards this way. But let's go down that way. The water coming along. It's very good. Very good. So far, so good. Any I'm enjoying uh, the all the way. Huh? How's your body holding up? Uh, very well, huh? Very well. Uh, for no now. sauce, no cramps. Yeah, so far, so good. Okay, good. Thank okay, keep on going. See you guys. Not bad. Okay. No injuries, no sauce. Uh, good. Okay, good. Keep on going. So you guys look more stressed if you guys start this. What's your secret? Do you have some hidden formula you've got inside your pack or something like that? No. So now, now you're kind of going to be under the hot spot. It's going to be hot, it's going to be humid. Um, what's your race tactic from here? Uh, it's not going to change. So we're just going to take it enjoy the scenery. Okay. Well, we'll catch you guys later. You guys refill with water yep. and just take it. Welcome to the North Face 100. This is checkpoints 3, 4 and 5. The first official water point where athletes can stock up on their water and, and their hydro pump and if they need some medical attention. And we've just been told that a couple of athletes have just dropped out due to uh, cramping and due to fatigue. So this race has really taken a toll on some of the athletes. This garden, which is one of the very few in Singapore, is actually part of the North Face 100 route goes through it. And so you see people coming down here, and they're actually going inside to refill the water and to uh, rub some deep heat if they're having cramps. And then they'll come back, back, come back here, up, out here, and go up, and then they'll come back down here again. So it's a couple of loops before they continue the race. And once they finish this loop, they'll be heading back towards McRitchie, and. Um, that's going to be, and that's the second half of the race. So right now, they're at about the halfway stage. They're about 25k, and it's probably another 25k to go. Okay, it's a bit cooler here. So as they go through the jungle, it's going to be cool. It's not going to be as hot, but it's still going to be rough because the ground's uneven, and they, the athletes will have to wash the balance. It might be a bit soggy as well. Let's make our way inside. Yeah, about the halfway stage. Yeah, how do you feel? Uh, <laughs> very, very tired. <laughs> My teammate. Yeah. Okay. Hello. What's your name? Amy. Hey, okay, my name's Mark. Yeah. And you are? Chun Tran. <laughs> Alright, so are you feeling the same way? Is the yeah. feeling neutral? Yeah, I feel like I finished 42 already. <laughs> <laughs> on a normal marathon. Okay. <laughs> very short. It's too have, tiring. Have you learned a lot? Yeah, yeah, yeah. One thing, uh, we should prepare ourselves better. I think. <laughs> <laughs> How about equipment wise? Would you guys change anything? Equipment wise, apparel, footwear, socks? I, mean, I think we are fine, it's just that we need to carry more food. Okay. <laughs> we realize that we short of uh, race fuel. Okay. Okay. Yeah. okay. We won't hold you guys back. Thanks. Thank I'll you. Guys yeah. Alright, see you guys at the end. Hey, welcome to the North Face 100. We're currently in the Gangla Trail. We're making our way up to the butterfly trail. Let's go. Runner, we're so fresh. Hey, yeah. He's going strong. Let's go. <laughs> now these guys are probably about halfway through, and they're still going strong. Their legs are keep keep moving, keep pumping. The minute they stop, they might just suffer cramps or might just lose the momentum. So they have to continue running. Hang on, hang on. It's a uh, cramp, right? Okay, okay. Uh, 
about 10 minutes away. Yeah. Thanks a lot. Okay. Okay, Quick, the teammate. It's way behind. Way behind, right? I'll uh, we'll just go on a few minutes, Marshall. Give them a shot. He's uh, decided to, to get up and continue the race even through cramp. So uh, all the best. We'll see you at the finish. Sure. Uh, that is what you call mongrel. Injured, but still wanting to continue. Great job. And see, he's starting to run as well. Let's just hope that he finishes the race. Because these guys like that, who put in that effort, really deserve to finish races. These are the guys who are the heart and soul of an endurance race like that. Hey. Okay, we've just received news that the first runner has actually gone past checkpoint 5 and is actually on the way back to McRitchie. We're heading back to McRitchie, but right now it's about 11.50, 10 minutes to 12, and it started raining in the forest. So we're actually going to make our way out and hopefully it doesn't become a big downpour. 